Victor Wembanyama has been making waves across courts and the headlines, possessing an uncanny ability to dominate the game from both ends of the court. Wembanyama has ignited a frenzy of excitement and curiosity. Basketball legend LeBron James even called him an alien because of his extraordinary height and otherworldly talents. But beyond the stats lie an untold story about his family and life beyond the arena. Join us as we unravel the layers of his personal life, the mentors who shaped him, and the aspirations that drive him to reach new heights. Born on January 4, 2004, in Le Chenet, France, Wembenyama has captured the attention of numerous basketball aficionados, widely acknowledging him as an exceptional prospect. His remarkable potential and skills have drawn parallels to LeBron James, whose emergence in 2003 left an indelible mark on the sport. Since his debut performance in the US against the NBA G League Ignite, he was considered one of the strongest candidates to be drafted in the NBA, which did happen when he was selected first overall by the San Antonio Spurs in the 2023 draft. Standing at 7 foot and 3 inches tall with an 8 foot long wingspan, the 18 year old Frenchman has been recognized as a generational talent. Averaging 36.5 points, 7.5 rebounds, 2 assists, 1 steal, and 4.5 blocks across his two preseason series between the LNB Pro A side Metropolitan 92 and the G League Ignite in Las Vegas, Nevada. But Wembenyama isn't the only athlete in his family. His father, Felix Wembenyama, is from the Democratic Republic of Congo. He was a high jumper a sport that requires explosive power and agility to clear high bars. Unsurprisingly, he excelled in the sport thanks to his height of 6 feet and 5 inches. Felix also holds several records in track and field, such as a triple jump record of 15.56 meters and a long jump record of 7.41 meters and the impressive feat of running 100 meters in just 11 seconds. About his father, Wembenyama said, Dad gave me the passion for knowing subjects in depth, being a real technician of sports, of whatever I do. However, the teen prodigy didn't get his basketball chops from Felix, but from his mother. Elodie de Futuro also has a basketball background, having been a former basketball player herself who represented the French national basketball team. Standing at 6'2", Elodie was a proficient player herself during her time. Today, she worked as a coach for Yves Noir Basketball Academy. Victor's grandfather, Michel de Futuro, also once played basketball at a high level, being a part of the Paris University Club hoops team in France's top basketball league. His older sister, Yves, also plays professional basketball and won a gold medal with France at the 2017 FIBA U16 Women's European Championship. Currently, she plays for Monaco in the French LF2 League, the French second division in women's basketball. His younger brother, Oscar, is also into sports, and at just 15 years old, already stands at 6 feet 6 inches. Originally, Oscar tried pursuing the sport of handball, but eventually followed in the footsteps of his other siblings and entered basketball. In 2020, he made his debut for Nanterre's U15 team, which is a team that his older brother Victor also played for. Today, he plays for Asbel, a team owned by NBA legend Tony Parker in the EuroLeague and LNB Pro A. Initially, Wembenyama engaged in football as a goalkeeper and pursued judo before eventually honing his attention on basketball. When he was only 7 years old, Wembenyama started his basketball journey with Entente Le Chine Versailles. As he continued to progress, he transitioned to the youth development program of Nanterre 92 at the age of 10, further nurturing his basketball talents. Victor Wembanyama's journey to professional basketball began when he was spotted while playing for an under-11 team in Versailles. During a game when Wembanyama was playing, basketball coach Michael Allard attended as a spectator and noticed the player's unusually long and impressive frame. However, Allard was initially under the impression that this person was an assistant coach due to his physical presence. Recognizing Wimbanyama's potential, Michael Allard and the Nanterre 92 Basketball Club quickly took action and wasted no time recruiting Wimbanyama to join their youth development program. And it seemed like Wimbanyama was already ahead of the curve. He had taught himself English during his early teen years knowing that he wanted to play in the NBA one day and that English was the language of basketball people. 
on October 29, 2019, when Benyama made his official basketball debut with Nanterre 92 in the French Pro A League, the top professional basketball league in France. At that time, he was just 15 years old and was the youngest player to ever participate in the Euro Cup, a prestigious basketball club tournament featuring professional basketball teams from various European countries. Despite his young age and limited playing time, when Benyama managed to step onto the court and show off his extraordinary skills, averaging 11.3 points, 5.1 rebounds, and 1.3 blocks per game, and marking the beginning of what many hoped would be a long and successful career in professional basketball. In October 2020, a video of Victor Wembanyama playing a two-on-two -two pickup game against Utah Jazz center Rudy Gobert and Vincent Poirier went viral. The video quickly gained millions of views, with fans, analysts, and fellow players marveling at his potential, further reinforcing his status as a young talent to watch out for and making Wembenyama a household name among basketball fans. It showed Wembenyama, who was only 16 years old at the time, holding his own against two of the best centers in the NBA. He showed off his incredible length and athleticism, blocking shots, making jumpers, and finishing at the rim with ease. Gobert and Poirier were clearly impressed by Wembenyama's talent, and they were even seen laughing and joking with him after the game. Victor Wembenyama's US debut in October 2022 marked a significant milestone in his basketball journey, capturing the attention of basketball enthusiasts, scouts, and NBA executives alike. He was praised for his size, athleticism, and defensive potential. Many analysts believe he is the most talented prospect to come out of Europe since Kristaps Porzingis. The debut involved a series of two exhibition games against the NBA G League Ignite team, an elite developmental squad that features young prospects aiming to make their mark in the NBA. In the first game, Wembenyama scored 37 points, grabbed 5 rebounds, and blocked 5 shots. He also had 4 steals and 2 assists. The Ignite won the game 122-115. In the second game, Wembenyama scored 36 points, grabbed 11 rebounds, and blocked two shots. He also had three steals and one assist. The Metropolitans 92 won the game 112 to 106. During an interview in October 2022, 38-year-old NBA legend LeBron James playfully hinted at Wembenyama's otherworldly skill set. We're labeling like this unicorn thing. Everybody's been a unicorn over the last few years, but he's more like like an alien. No one has ever seen anyone. Despite LeBron's praises for the young talent, not everyone is convinced that Wembenyama can live up to expectations. One of them is NBA legend Charles Barkley, who has said that the young phenom looks like he's great, but you can't really tell until he gets to the NBA. Barkley points out that physicality in the NBA is something that Wembenyama may have trouble adjusting to. Victor's path to success has been guided by a network of mentors who recognized his potential and played crucial roles in his development. One of the most influential figures in his journey is Pascal Donadieu, the head coach of Nanterre 92. Donadieu's mentorship extended beyond basketball, encompassing discussions about philosophy, art, and life. Off the court, Victor Wembanyama is not just a basketball prodigy. He is also a renaissance man in the making. In an August 2022 interview with ESPN2, Wembanyama said that he feels like he is an artist on and off the court. He loves thinking about a lot of things and working on getting an art piece done, aside from building Legos, writing, and listening to classical music. More than just a once-in-a-lifetime athlete, Wembanyama is also quite the learner. He was already an avid reader by the age of three and helped his mother coach young basketball players that were his age when he was just nine. Despite being French, Wembenyama speaks English quite well, making it easy for him to adapt in the US. He learned the language in his early teens by watching English language videos on Instagram as well as American TV shows. To make his NBA dream possible, Victor has been following an extreme diet since his early teens. His team and him have implemented to strengthen his feet and prevent injuries such as crawling on his toes. He also placed a great importance on sleeping, aiming for a generous 10 to 11 hours of sleep a day, and follows a careful diet to fuel his muscles while maintaining his optimal weight. All this commitment is already paying off outside the court. Wembenyama's net worth is estimated to be around $3 million, 
Now that he's in the NBA, that net worth can skyrocket pretty fast very soon, with his $12 million salary per year. In essence, the enigma of Victor Wembanyama encompasses more than a record-breaking athlete. It's a narrative that merges talent with family legacy, spotlight with philosophy, and aspiration with challenges. His journey is a reminder that even behind the most dazzling court performances, a human story is waiting to be told. What facts about Victor Wembanyama surprised you most? Let us know in the comments down below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel.